G'day guys, Tiny here from Off Tap Brewing. Just uh, made myself a acid bath for my kegs, my keggles. So I've got uh, one over here that's uh, it's clean on the inside. I've used it a couple of times, but I would like it a bit better. But I don't want to do the effort on it. So this is what I've come up with today. My little acid bath. Okay, so in there, that one's been in a fire. That one I doused in fire heaps and heaps. Um, and there's an, a, you can see it getting cleaner towards the bottom. But I'm gonna go out on Monday and get a, a lot more citric acid to add to that. So basically I, I can just lower it. <laughs> lower it. Into the citric acid mix. And it'll just sink in there because there is a hole in the bottom ready for the ball valve. And yeah, what I'm going to do is just leave that sit over over today and add more citric acid tomorrow. Uh, leave that sit till it's clean. Hopefully, I can get it clean by doing this. That's like low effort, low effort shit. Got my hoist, which will lift it in and out. This um, was a 44 uh, gallon drum I cut the top off, um, a food grade 44. So what I'm going to use that for is once I've cleaned this, I'm going to keep filling it with citric acid and use it for um, cleaning my kegs in and out, just give a, a good rinse um, outside and inside, blah, 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 by soaking them in there, doing the same thing, soaking them in some nice citric acid for 20 minutes or so, um, and then pulling them out and washing them off. Pressure check them. I'm also going to pressure check them in this as well so um you know fill it with water for your keg for your keg with you know almost full to the top with water and then pressurize it to pouring pressure um to check for leaks on your keg so maybe i might do another update on doing that uh, i know i've got a tip in five minutes and under before i do it in the bathtub so now i've just um you know basically cleaned out my bathtub i could do fermenters and everything in here Actually, that'd make the missus happy. There's a dude walking in the road. All sus. That's all right. That's all good. He's going down the pub. I built a pub. Yeah. So yeah, that's uh, that's my um little update for you guys. My um my little scrub here. Even did the mop bucket. Uh, the mop today. Put the mop in some citric acid. Give a bit of a clean off. So I'm just hoping that it'll take all that carbon off from the fire. Yeah, and then we'll, there's enough water in there, once I've cleaned it out and put water in there, to check, you know, gas spines and leaks on regulators and all that sort of stuff. So yeah, I'll be doing some testing on my equipment, which, um, you know, you got to do once in a while, otherwise you're losing a shitload of gas. All right, guys. Um, cheers. I'm drinking a um, a Pom's Breath English Bitter. Uh, this is the experimental one where I double rule the hops in it. Very, very good. Just have a lovely weekend. Mine's over. Cheers.